Sleeping Queen back again with another video. I mean, as you guys know, we are consistent. If you're new here, thank you for stopping by. Please don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Trust me, you're going to love it here. And if you're a returning subscriber, then thank you so, so much for coming back. So today is day one of our vloggy vlog vlog. I literally just finished filming a mini skincare routine for TikTok and Instagram Reels. And now I am, you know, ready for the day. I... I'm about to get dressed. Let me just show you guys what I'm going to be wearing. I'm really excited to wear this denim dress. As you guys can see, it is very cute. Um, I got this from Zara. Yeah. When I bought it, I didn't try it on. So you guys are going to be seeing firsthand how it looks on me. Okay, guys. So this is how the final look is. This is me with the dress on. Yeah, it's giving very much, you know, like spring vibes. Um, but I'm not too sure, guys. I feel like this outfit is just too cute for what I'm going to be doing today, guys. Like, I I don't believe in saving outfits, but I don't want to, like, waste outfits on, like, absolutely nothing kind of thing. So, I don't know if I should just go like this or if I should change. What do you guys think? Should I just go like this? And then, um... It's very really hot these days, so um, ideally I'll be wearing sandals. Like ideally I'll be wearing sandals. But I don't know, guys. I just feel like maybe I should just change into something else and then save this outfit for when I'm actually like gonna be doing something interesting. Okay, guys. So I actually decided that you know what? I'm just not gonna change. I'm just gonna go like this, and this is a full outfit of the day. Check. As I told you guys before, I'm wearing this denim dress and I have this headband. Actually, I want it to be a neck bow, but I've seen a couple of people wearing it as a headband. So I decided that, you know what, since my lace front is looking absolutely atrocious today, let me just use it as a headband and then I'm going to be using this bag and I'm wearing white shoes. Yeah guys, let's go. Let's get some bananas. I love bananas so so much. I am also going to take some oranges. And of course I'm gonna be taking this mince curry and rice. I'm trying to eat a little bit healthier so hopefully this helps. Guys, I am literally fighting the urge to get some coke. I just feel like I need to just cut down on my sugar like i don't know what alternative i can get um maybe i can just get some juice i don't know but i need to chill on the coke honestly don't believe me i am a true liar i just can't help myself oh my goodness guys <laughs> and i'm also just gonna get some popcorn i'm gonna opt for this one that kind of like extends outwards um as opposed to this one because i just feel like this one might slightly be a little bit more convenient guys if you can ask me why i am at la parada for drinks i'm at the fine la parada not the other one guys i layer and in main but yeah i'm literally here for drinks because i was just getting into stuff at Woolworth and then i just figured like let me just come to um, either Tashis or La Parada for drinks because I am very parched guys. I've had such a long day. I just obviously couldn't vlog everything because... Hi. I'm good in you. Yeah, I want this drink. I'm not too sure what the name is. Uh, it looks like what I'm using. It has Red Bull in it, ne? Yes. Yeah, I want this. Non-alcoholic, ne? Sure. Alright, thank you. Yeah guys, this is the drink that I want. Yeah, I don't know why I came to like I really wanted that drink because it's very nice. But then food wise, La Prada sucks, guys. I'm not gonna lie to you. Ah, the food, the food sucks. So it's like no one can do food either. Like it smells so bad. My goodness. Yeah, I hope the smell goes away soon. But anyways, guys, I'm gonna catch up with you later. I don't think I'm gonna eat. Here. I think I'm just gonna take my drink and eat because yeah, no, guys, food is good, but life is better. So. I, Having my drink, it is very good. I'm not gonna lie, guys. Um, I think it's called the watermelon bowl. I can't quite remember what um, the gentleman said, but if you can rewind, you'll hear what he said. This drink is lovely. 
Mm. Now I'm just waiting for the sushi. I just decided to order sushi because I just felt like it's gonna be a little bit awkward if I just come here for a drink and then leave. Plus, like, I'm not hungry, hungry, but I could definitely eat. He gave me, like, I, I could use a little bit of chewing. Just a little bit of chewing. So I just ordered something very, very light. I ordered a California roll salmon. Um, I'm a bit unsure because I'm not gonna lie, guys. As I had said before, the food here sucks. So they better not mess up a California roll. Otherwise, I'm gonna wrap. I am going to be very upset. So, yeah, so far so good. It's a wrap! <laughs> it's a wrap, guys. I'm so tired. Like, I'm not gonna lie. And continuation, guys. Today has been such a long day. I just wanna go home. Put some gym. Need that pants. It's so cold. And I'm wearing the teeny tiny dress that you guys saw earlier on, so you can imagine how I'm feeling now. Like, it's literally 21 degrees, but it's windy, so it feels like it feels like it's 15 degrees. You get me? So I just want to play and go, and then I'm probably gonna catch up with you guys tomorrow. I don't know if like the Lambie or if this croissant was so good. See this baby right here. Look at how I ate that. Look at how I ate that. <laughs> I finished this croissant in two minutes. Like the girl literally took it out of the oven for me and she was like, baby girl, here is your croissant. And I was like, thank you, my love. Okay, guys. The barista is so sweet, guys. She is such a sweetheart. And then um I ordered the pumpkin spice frappuccino. Why am I saying frappuccino? I ordered the pumpkin spice latte, but it's like warm. As you guys can see, the cup is like a to be quite honest guys i wasn't too sure if i was gonna like it but it's actually like i'm not mad about it like i'm not i'm not in love with it but i'm also like not mad about it so yeah um i'm gonna be leaving soon guys <laughs> i'm gonna be leaving soon um i think i also want ice cream like guys i just want all the foods in the world and that i think that's why i gain weight because I mean, I just man, call it like so yeah. A little bit different today usually um when i like you know get ready for wherever i'm going i'll either have no makeup or i'll only have powder or i'll have like foundation and concealer and everything like it's either those the options today i literally just put on concealer and i just hope that i don't look too crazy i hope i don't look too crazy so the reason why i'm even up so early and I even put on concealer and everything is because today I am writing my learner's license for the third time <laughs> for the third time so the first time I had actually failed and I was so so embarrassed and I was just so ashamed of myself because I just felt like oh my goodness like how do you feel the easiest part of this whole thing? Because the learner's test is supposed to be the easiest part. Well, it wasn't that easy to me because I failed. So I was just so embarrassed. And I had even gotten it in one of like my older vlogs, in one of the vlogs that I had um, made private. So the real ones, the regular diggers, the day ones, no, the vlog that I'm talking about, I was just so damn bad, guys. I was, you know, and then after that i went back again and then i got my learners this was the second time that i wrote and you know everything was all good but i'm like really like genuinely scared of driving guys like i am genuinely like scared you get me so i went for like a few lessons and then i just stopped because like 
guys when tsaba like put i need dnd see guys i was scared i just stopped and then two years went by because my learning is even expired it expired last year mind you it expired last year and then from last year until now it's actually been over a year because it expired last year in january and now it's september so it's almost two years that it's expired and i was just like not i didn't care about you know renewing it doing whatever like you know and then um, a few days ago i actually got this like i don't want to say burst of energy or burst of motivation or whatever but yeah i decided that you know what let me do this thing for real let me go get my learners let me get my driver's license let me be a licensed babe you get me so i was actually supposed to write my test um in Santon on monday but then i managed to get a slot for centurion for today today's friday and i only got the slot yesterday so i was like you know what let me actually just take this earlier slot so that i don't have the weekend to kind of like change my mind because i know myself guys like i'm like i'm really scared guys like yo guys i need tnds like nyasa but yo but i was just like you know let me just the sooner that i can get it done and get it over with like the better i'll feel so that's why i was like you know what if there's a slot for early on let me just take that slot let me go do this thing and then i'm gonna be taking you guys with me for my learner's test wish me luck guys wish me luck and um i tried to go with kids because i know they're going to be taking a picture and i'm not sure like after i get my license i'm not sure if i'm still going to leave my learners but i know that i just want the picture to be you know decent <laughs> and also like i didn't you guys know this week this week is my I don't want to be seen wait, I don't want to, I don't want to, so that's why I just put this hairband on it because the, the lace front is looking so crazy, <laughs> it's looking so, so crazy. And yeah, my outfit of the day, um, this body suit is from H&M, the jeans are by girlfriend, and then the shoes, I am wearing this pair of Jordan 4s, this is in the sea foam green. And yeah, guys, let's go. I am here at the Centurion Licensing Department. I am literally um, about to. Okay, guys, I'm about to train. So, got to go, guys. So, I just finished writing. Everything went so, so well. I'm just waiting here because I'm. Um, they still need my picture, they need um, my certificate for my eyes and I'm just eating a chocolate and I'm so tired guys, wow I greet you all in the name of a learner's license oh my goodness guys Past my learners, I'm so happy, I'm so excited. I'm sure you guys can even see from the smile on my face. I'm not gonna lie, I'm so nervous because you know what? This is my third time writing, and you know what? Third time's a charm, so I'm just glad that everything went out. Now I can really have the headache of my life. You have a headache, and I am also just hungry and I'm just tired. It's been a long morning. Guys, like I think I woke up at half past six, and since then I've just been going up and down and going to places that I'm not familiar with and stuff. So yeah, I'm very overstimulated, I'm very tired, but I'm just gonna go home and then I'm gonna get something to eat and just rest, guys. I deserve it after a good day's work. vlog guys i'm not gonna lie i haven't picked up the camera in a minute and i missed you guys so so much and um 
Yeah, today we are going out with a friend. We are going to be going to this cafe. Let me just see if I'm doing public. Yeah, we're going to this cute cafe in Centurion. It's called La Creamerie. I saw it on TikTok, and funny enough, today in the morning she had texted me saying, Let's go to Tasha's. And I was like, You know what? Let's actually not go to Tasha's. Let's go to La Creamerie. And um, I was just like binge watching it on TikTok, and it looked amazing the aesthetics were giving and you know 10 out of 10 i'm very excited to go there and um before i show you guys my outfit of the day i just need to do a quick unboxing for you guys so i actually got these things some time back like a few weeks ago yeah and then um but because i wasn't vlogging like i didn't actually like get the chance to unbox it for you guys on youtube let's get to it I don't know which one to open first, but let me just open this one here. And guys, as I had already shown you guys in my other unboxing, um, this is how the box looks. And because it is almost Christmas season, the ribbons look like this. As you guys can see, this is kind of like the festive season ribbon color. Because I mean, like, it is almost festive season. It is already October. So, yeah, time has gone by. And I'm just going to open this one first because it's the one that's on top. Mind you, when I chose my stuff, this was actually not my first choice. I'm not going to lie. My first choice was a different sandal. But they didn't have my size. They only had a size um we only had a size three and i already have that sandal in black but i just wanted it in a different color because it looked very beautiful and are you guys ready drum roll please <laughs> this is the sandal that i chose and funny enough this is actually a size three but i noticed with the shoes in gucci like you need to be aware that the different cuts are going to make you have like a different size so even though i'm a size four for this shoe because like it's kind of like it's, it's a slide guys like you know you're gonna <laughs> so i had to size down because like there's so much room and my toes were going to be you know like if i chose a size four my foot was going to look like i borrowed it like it was gonna look too big so i chose a size three and yeah this color is very stunning guys as you can see um the shoe that i wanted was also in this color but it was a different design the design that i wanted was um the thong sandal i'm sure you guys have seen the black sandal that i'm talking about the one that has the gg on the front and it's a thong sandal yeah that's the one that i wanted but unfortunately they didn't have my size this is the shoe that i'm talking about for those of you who don't know so this shoe actually also comes in like the same color as the sandal that i just showed you guys and i have it in black but i wanted it in a different color so hopefully next time when i do go to gucci or when i order from gucci i can get it in my size and now on to the big one guys i actually chose sandals for both my purchases um, it's becoming hot and you know I'm a sandal kind of girl so this one should actually come as no surprise this is actually the shoe that I want to wear today um yeah this baby right here how cute is she she is so so cute and then for this one this is the size three and a half so I also had to size down a little bit because like there's a lot of space here like it is a slide so your foot is going to be sliding so you need to size down a little bit and i was aware that if i choose a size four it's gonna look like i borrowed it and that's just not that's just not cute do you get me so yeah this is actually gonna be my shoe for today and then i'm just gonna be putting on um i'm going to wear that's neck bow but i'm gonna wear it as a hairband because you can actually use it as a neck bow or a hairband 
because my list is looking so crazy right now and yeah guys let me just finalize my outfit and then i will show you guys the full outfit before we step out oh my goodness guys look at this package that i just received from jo malone and it is these bag sized perfume bottles oh my goodness okay this is the english pear and sweets pea and how many milliliters is this okay this is 30 milliliters yeah 30 milliliters and then this is the english pear and freesia um i already have two bottles of this joe malone gifted me two bottles of this baby right here and it smells amazing guys oh my goodness and i just think it's so cute how they made it in like a pear shape like how creative is this this is so creative and it was obviously wrapped with this bow but it was wrapped into a bow rather and then um this also came in the package and behind the notes oops it's personalized so it literally says dear dino we are pleased to introduce our english pear and sweet pea cologne how cool is this oh my word i am not too sure how i feel about my makeup today you know sometimes you beat your face and you feel like yeah today i beat my face today i'm not sure guys i don't know if it's because of the eyeshadow that i used so i used this palette by huda beauty it's the color blocking palette guys and it's a little bit out of my comfort zone i specifically just used this one right here this really shiny 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 glittery one but um yeah or maybe it's because i don't have lashes on right now and i don't want to do my individual lashes because i just feel like i just don't want to do them <laughs> like like i literally like i'm phony like i just don't want i'm just trying to let my natural lashes grow and i just put on some mascara guys funny enough right i noticed that the older i become the less i feel the need to um confirm ooh, not confirm conform rather to like these like social media beauty standards kind of thing like if i don't have my lashes done or if i don't have my nails done or if my hair is not done or whatever like i won't feel any type of way about it like i feel like the older that i become the more i i want to say the more i appreciate my natural beauty and the more i appreciate myself in my natural form because like if this was me like maybe like two years ago guys like when i was 20 you would not catch me without my lashes being done because i felt like oh my goodness i look like such a bum my lashes are not done my nails are not done then i realized that wait subconsciously that means that i believe that me in my natural state looks like a bum and that's not supposed to be like that like it's not supposed to be like that you're supposed to really appreciate yourself in your natural state you're supposed to appreciate yourself with your wig lines you're supposed to appreciate yourself with this control like you know that kind of thing like we don't always have to be done up and always have to be looking you know to the nines or whatever like just the way that you are like just appreciate that and i feel like not even to be deep or anything guys but i'm really just appreciating my natural self you know so anyways, back to what I was saying. I'm not sure about the makeup. Yeah. I don't know guys. I think I think it's because I didn't put on um I didn't put on strip lashes. And you know sometimes like when you have makeup on and you don't have lashes, like you feel a bit awkward, you know. I think it's that because I don't look bad. I don't look bad at all. I don't know guys. Yeah. Anyways, um, 
I'm going to be leaving home now because it's like already two and we've been talking about this whole lunch thing it was actually supposed to be a brunch even and like I haven't eaten all day because I was saving my appetite for this place like I'm so excited to go there and the food better not disappoint and yeah guys as I, sh as I had mentioned before um, I did put on the headband because my lace was looking crazy and when I get back home I'm going to remove this wig I'm going to remove this wig I just wasn't sure which hairstyle I want to do next because I just feel like it's hot for wigs and I also had um, I had box braids not long ago I also had you know that half up half down not long ago so like what hairs am I going to do now guys like Please do give me ideas in the comment section. And yeah. So, full outfit of the day. Yeah. I'll put this one down. And I am wearing the shoes I told you guys about. Yeah. Full outfit from Revolve. And yeah, let's go. <laughs> Oh my goodness guys, I haven't vlogged with this camera and with this tripod in like forever. Okay, I think that's fine. Yeah, so we are here at the Creamery and I am a little bit late because my friend Katja um, like 10 minutes ago or so but she just went to the restroom and so far it's very cute I'm actually glad that she chose this spot for us to sit because you know what it's so pretty I think I'm going to get a few good instant <laughs> Box color blocking eyeshadow look. What do you want to say? What do you want to say? Come here. Give me the chance. <laughs> Alrighty, we are going to do a taste test. Oh, sorry. <laughs> and we are about to step out as you guys can see i am literally just going with my cornrows and this cap i'm just putting the cap on because my cornrows are not as neat as i would like them to be but i'm gonna get that fixed and i'm just wearing this full outfit from cotton on and then as my bag i'm using my valenciaga hourglass bag 
And then these are my shoes for the day. So guys, this is the drink that I ordered. I ordered the pumpkin spice iced latte in the venti size and this is so cute so he literally wrote my name and then the heart is supposed to be the O <laughs> how cute is that and then to eat I ordered the bacon and cheese sandwich I am starving and for dessert I bought this milk chocolate chip cookie yeah I can't wait to dig in. Oh my goodness, guys. This is your gentle reminder to please use your Click Club card. So for all of this, um, I got toilet paper. I got a new toothbrush. I got toothpaste. I got this mini cotton glue. I got lip balm. I got gum. I only paid 20 rand for this, guys. Like for all of this, I used... 20 rand and then the rest was my cashback reward from my kids club card and then for movers i got popcorn i also got um these sweets i got um bananas oranges this is what i'm going to be having for dinner tonight and then i also got some water there was a special that was going to for 90 rand and I think one packet of these is like 65 rand so it kind of made sense for me to just get the two for 90 rand and then I also got this milk and future life guys if you want to gain weight nah, if you want to gain weight this baby right here is going to be your friend okay don't say I didn't tell you so guys, this marks the end of the video. I hope that you enjoyed watching. Please don't forget to give this video a huge thumbs up and subscribe if you're not subscribed yet. I hope that you enjoyed. Until next time, this is it from the Consistent Queen. Bye!